if you're African, I need you to watch this very attentively. Let it sink in. Let the message sink in. Take it in. Assimilate it. And I'll catch you on the other side. Or well, think about the Sahel region. One of the poorest, yes, yet fastest growing demographically. The succession of military coups will make the region more unstable for years ahead. Russia is both influencing and benefiting from the crisis, and the region has become fertile ground to the rise of terrorism. This is of direct concern for Europe, for our security and our prosperity. So we need to show the same unity of purpose towards Africa as we have shown towards Ukraine. This is a must. We need to focus on cooperation with legitimate governments and regional organizations. We need to develop a mutually beneficial partnership which focuses on common issues for Europe and Africa. And this is why, together with HRVP Borrell, we will work on a new strategic approach to take forward at the, new, at the next EU-AU summit. Honourable Members, history is on the move. Russia is waging a full-scale war against the founding principles of the UN Charter. This has raised immense concerns in countries from Central Asia to the Indo-Pacific. They are worried that in a lawless world, they might face the same fate as Ukraine. So that was European Council's Ursula von der Leyen speaking on the floor of the European Parliament, laying out the plan they are cooking up for Africa. What they are cooking up for Africa is exactly what they have going on in Ukraine right now. So I am making this video for Africans. Now, you know what is going on in Ukraine. You see the destruction of both lives and property that is going on in Ukraine right now. According to Ursula von der Leyen, this is what they're planning for Africa. We know they have a depopulation agenda. So what I understand is that they started in Ukraine now they are planning to transfer it to Africa. Starving us of food, stopping the, the grain um, exports to Africa is not enough for them. They now want to bring the physical debt with weapons to come and kill Africans because that's exactly what they're going to do. There is nothing about democracy that is happening in Ukraine right now. There is nothing about freeing Ukrainian people that is happening over there unless you consider death, freedom, I guess. This is what they are planning for Africans. Now, um, you have seen this. I want every African to kick against this before it happens. You have your government. This is no time to play. This is the time to let your government know that under no circumstances should they allow these people come into Africa for no reason, under no circumstances at all. I don't care whether your government, your leader is a puppet. If he's a puppet, you guys should right now start to make him understand that this will not be tolerated. We cannot let this happen. Africa cannot afford to allow these people in to come and do to our continent what they are doing to ukraine right now we must take this up we must start a movement in our different countries let the government know that this is a hill we are ready to die on we cannot allow them bring these people in this this is gone beyond child's play right now this is gone beyond i don't care what happens because when if it, if it happens everybody in africa will pay the price this cannot happen please 
whatever you can do, in whatever way you can put pressure on your government, start doing it right now. These people don't speak for no reason. If they are speaking about this, it means the plan has already been led. We cannot let them bring their death and destruction into Africa.